What's up, Internet? This is Rambling Josh, and you're watching another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X. You may notice that I sound a little bit different today, and there's a very good reason for that. I got myself a new headset. And this guy gives us a high potion. Isn't there a guy over here? Here we have ourselves a new enemy. The, this is the Basilisk. We want to use the Lancet on these guys with Kamari because, as you can see, that teaches us Stone Breath. As you can probably imagine, these guys can be kind of nasty because they use this Stone Gaze ability, which has a chance of turning you to stone which is usually a bad thing. So, want to watch out for them. Try and take them out quickly. Although... That's not good. Uh, I do still like to try and get AP for everyone. Uh, oh, that, that was the wrong button. Let's see if we can't finish this thing off with Lulu. Yeah, it should go down. Do you have anything to give me? No, you don't. What a cheapskate. So, anyways, we're just heading down this way towards, I believe this is actually called the Jose High Road. Hey, a soft ring. Uh, that's for Yuna? Yeah. Let's put that on. One thing you might want to consider doing with uh, basilisks is if uh, Waka knows sleep attack. Uh, you may want to sleep one of the basilisks while you kill the other one if, there, if there's more than one basilisk in the battle. Just so that uh, the other one's not gonna stone you while you're taking out the other one. Also, with that stone ring, or uh, soft ring rather, that I just got, you might be thinking to yourself, you know, how useful is that gonna be if uh, there's if one person doesn't have, it can't be stoned. And the thing is, it's for it's uh, prevents Yuna from getting stoned, and she has Asuna, which can de-stone your other party members. So it can be pretty useful. It's always kinda nasty if uh, the person, namely Yuna, that you switch in to heal your other party members gets stoned. So, there's some new enemies here. Simurg and bite bugs. They're pretty standard stuff though, nothing too special about them. They're flying, but by now, you know, it shouldn't be too hard for you to, uh, even characters other than Waka to hit the flying enemies. I'm not sure if they have any elemental weakness, but yeah battle like that, it just goes by so fast, it's almost not even worth uh, switching in party members for. Ether is always handy. Now let's see here. That's the thing about this game, really. Even when you have new enemies, a lot of times they just end up being, you know, 
your standard enemy archetypes like you got your flyers, your elementals, your flan thingies, you got your heavily armored enemies and so on and so forth. Now let's see here. Fairly certain there's supposed to be a chest around here somewhere. Unless I'm thinking of somewhere else. I know there's I know there was a chest here of course, but I thought there was another one. But maybe it's just on the next screen. I guess there's only one way to find out. Oh, actually I just found Isn't it maybe it was for someone else? Ah, there it is. Soft bangle. And I got this too. Uh fossil Kate Sith. Which I guess can be kind of handy, uh, if you want to try and turn someone to stone, but Really, in general, you know, you don't really want Lulu attacking. Now then... Hey! How much longer till Xanarkin? Still a ways. First, down the moon flow to the Guado city of Guado Salam. Then we cross the Thunder Plains to the Temple of Makalania. Oh. Boy. <laughs> and before that, we get to pray at the temple in Jose. We can't just skip all that, can we? Huh? Mm -mm. I have to pray to the faith in every temple in order to earn the final aeon. That's a summoner's training. Yeah, usually there's, you know, a journey before you get to the final destination. Must be tough, Yuna. I'll be fine with you here. Hey, new guy. Hey, old guy. Who else? What can I do for you, boss? Don't tell Yuna you know about Sin and Jet. Huh? You know her. She would distance herself from you. We do not want that. I see. I think. Yeah, but even if I did say something, no one believed me, you know? Yuna would. She believed uh, you about Xanarkand. No point. Come to think of it, did I really have to know about Jekt? What about my feelings? Who cares about your you feelings? Out at a critical moment, becoming emotional. What? Me? Emotional? <laughs> I heard you were quite the crybaby. Yeah, maybe when I was a kid. Titus does have a tendency to a freak now. out a lot. Just a little. Hey, I still don't buy your story, you hear? Now, does this lead straight to Jose, or is there... Hmm. Well, I'm missing something on that road, so I'm gonna go find it, and when I do, I'll... Well, I'll be back then. Or maybe it won't let me actually go back there right now. Whoa. Whoa. What was that? You know, it is good to see you and your companions are well. Yourselves as well, Captain. We were worried. Praise be to Yevon. Oh. We escaped with our lives. But our troops were decimated. Of all our chocobos, only this one made it. Poor chocobos. We make pretty poor chocobo mounted forces without chocobos. We turned our backs on the teachings and cast away our faith. This, this is our just reward. I'm pretty sure this is because of sin, not because of... So many died in vain. Well, it I guess you kind of brought it upon yourselves. Just you know. But don't worry, we're here for you. We should never have ignored the teachings. Who knows, maybe that's why the maesters were there. Just like Oren said. 
Is that the Jose Temple? It sure is shaky. How does that even work? The lightning mushroom rock. It only opens when a summoner is addressing the fate. That means another summoner's already in there. Another summoner? What if it's Donna? Apparently there's a fair few of those around here. Right. In we go. But first, we should take a look around. There's an inn here, uh, but we can't really do a whole lot here yet. Unless you want to rest up. I think you can rest up. I guess not. Really, there's not much point in uh, doing that since there's a safe sphere, anyways. So I guess it kind of makes sense. If we look back here, we get some ability spheres. And if we come over here, the Chocobo Knights have moved over here. Uh, but we also get ourselves 4,000 gil. Hey, it's Gara. Luzu, he's. Where is he? I found him. He was torn in half. I... That's kind of graphic. That idiot. What? What do I do now? I can't do this. I'm going back to Besay. And depending on what you told Gata to do back in the uh, command center, uh, one or the other will die. Uh, in my case, I told Gata he should go to the front line, and so Luzu dies. If you tell him that he should stay put, he dies. It doesn't really matter which one you chose, I just think it's a more interesting story if Luzu dies. So you're a champion of the Evan now, Braska? My name's Titus, not Braska. I beg your pardon, but may I ask your name? I am Summoner Yuna, from the Isle of Besaid. And you are? As I thought. The daughter of Lord Braska. You have the look of your father. My father? You knew him? No. I have never met the man. Ah, my apologies. I am Isaru. What's up, dude? I am a summoner. Like you. I'm Fuzzy. Pleased to meet you. And I'm Moroda. I'm guarding my big brother here. Since I was a child, I've always looked up to Lord Braska. I wished I would someday become a high summoner like he was. You must have some of your father's talent in you. I believe you might. I don't know. Is summoning you. talent hereditary? I, I'm not really. I've only just become a summoner. Of course, I've no intention of losing either. So perhaps we should race to see who can defeat Sin first. No. Very well, then. I guess it's always good to have a little incentive. Isaru. Yuna, I beg your leave. Good luck to both of us. Yes. At any rate, tomorrow, the Cloister of Trials. So, 
with that, I'll see you later. Catch you next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy X.